Hello, hello. This is D from the Fish and Gardeners coming back at you. And I'm going to come back at you with this fruit right here. It's called a Anna, Anna Harding Kiwi. And this is it right here. So this kiwi fruit is small, bigger than grapes. It has no fuzz on it. It's cold hardy. That's like below 25 degrees. And it comes with a pollinator plant that come. It's called the meter kiwi. So I got this kiwi vine from fast growing um, trees. No, it's not a sponsor. That's just where I got it from. And as you can see, it grows right up the trellis by itself. Now, I did not train it up the trellis. It actually grows that way. And it's going to take this whole trellis over. So, we like kiwi. Now, this tastes more like pineapple-ish tangy as far as um, the taste of the fruit. And like I said, it's bigger than the average grape. Non-fuzzy. But we wanted to grow kiwi. And being in Central Florida, this is the only kiwi we can grow because it's cold hardy. And it goes right up that trellis. It's going to go all the way around that trellis right there. And like I said, when you do order this fruit tree, you're gonna they're gonna automatically send you the meter kiwi, which is the pollinator, to this. Um, let me see if you can see the difference. I don't know if you can really see the difference, but it's two down in here. Let's see. So that's one, and that's the other. Okay. So that's the pollinator. The meter is the pollinator for the kiwi um, vine. And that's going to grow up that trellis. Like I said, it's cold hardy. I'm in central Florida, the Orlando area. And this is the closest we're going to get to a kiwi growing here. So I just wanted to bring you this fruit right here. And I'm going to show you another ever-bearing. And this is, you know, ever-bearing when it starts growing. It's ever-bearing and ever-green. So it stays green throughout the cold season and all. This is also another ever-bearing fruit, and that's the strawberries that I got from the same place. I'll drop the description below of the nursery, online nursery that I bought it from. But this right here is, as you can see, and it actually gave me some strawberries. Now, when they first send it to you, they'll tell you to go ahead and pick the strawberries off of it and let it go ahead and grow so you can get a whole lot. So, basically, I've already started moving the slips. I'm not sure what you actually call them. But when they grow to, you know, the extra, I remove those and place them in different pots. So that I can have more strawberries. So by next year, I'll have a lot of strawberries. So what I'm going to constantly do is, as they grow... And you know how strawberry plants grow their little slits. I'm going to go ahead and place them in different areas. So I can wind up with more strawberries for next year. And this is another way I am growing my fruits. So basically I grow them and I separate them. I move them over and continue to grow them and separate them. So I can have more strawberries, whether it's more grapes. You know, have my own fruit store in my backyard. So this is just another quick video that I'm bringing to you of different fruits that you can grow in your backyard garden. Have a blessed day. Goodbye.